Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. As you know from the title below, this is the how to series. In this video, I focus on my foundation. So if you would like to see how I do my foundation on a daily basis, then definitely, definitely, definitely do keep watching. So Welcome to part two of the how to series and this time around I'll be doing foundation as you can see I've already done my brows that was in part one which I will link down below which is the brow routine um, but yes now we're going to be doing foundation and we're both going to be trying out a new foundation which is from Bobbi Brown this is one of the well known everybody's been going crazy over this foundation I finally got it I tend to let the hype die down a little bit and then I get the foundation. Normally, I'm fortunate enough that I don't have much to cover up on my face. So I just basically use the same concealer that I would use under my brows to clean up my brows. I basically use the same concealer on my face if there's certain areas on my face that I would need to cover up. So I've zoomed you in a little bit closer so you can see. The area around my eyes is a little bit darker than this part essentially of my face. Same goes with the area around my mouth which is also a little bit darker than this part of my face. So essentially what I do when that is the case, I just take a little bit of the concealer. I'm just gonna put a little bit on my hand. What I do is I take it on a finger and I Put it all over this area that's around my mouth it's okay a little bit of it goes on my lips as well it's not a big deal as you guys know I'm looking at a mirror slightly below you guys this is just to essentially cover up those um, dark marks I'm not a fan of those dark marks and they sometimes tend to peek through when I put on foundation without concealing with a little bit of this concealer. And this is normally my everyday foundation routine. This is how I would do my foundation every single day. As you can see, I've covered up a little bit here, which is sufficient enough for me. And then I take a little bit of the concealer again and I put some on my eyes. Trust me, when you're going to work, nothing is as fast as using your hands. Trust. Trust. And that's essentially what I would cover up. I really don't want to lie. That's essentially what I would cover up. That's what I worry about most of the time. I don't really care for my forehead and things like that. That's fine because I barely put anything on there anyway. The foundation we'll be testing and trying out today is this one. This is the Bobbi Brown Skin Longwear Weightless Foundation. My sister has been drumming me about getting this foundation and I finally have. So we're going to try this out. So it comes with a pump, which is fabulous. Kind of have to squeeze it a couple of times to get the product flowing and moving. There we go. One, ooh, two pumps. All right, let's see with two pumps how it's going to go. My color in uh, Bobbi Brown foundations is Warm Almond, which for me I've always noticed it to be a little bit on the um, orange side, but once I apply all the things to it and whatever, it seems to just be perfectly fine. I squirted up another because I just feel like two pumps are not, are not for me. So I may, <laughs> so I did, I squirted out another pump, so it's three pumps, a blender, blending sponge. This one is from Real Techniques. And then I just sort of blend right in. Mm -hmm. First time trying this one. Mm -hmm. Don't quite know. So technically I'm also reviewing it in my head. So I'm trying it for the first time and I'm also reviewing it. So I tend to press in and not swipe away because um, I, sometimes swiping away tends to leave streaks for me, which I don't quite like. When you press it in, um, it tends to look more natural, which I like. That's why I've always preferred to um, apply foundation with a blender over a brush, because I tend to feel like brushes leave streaks, and I don't quite like that. This is how my foundation will look on a daily basis. It's covered up pretty much everything what I've needed it to cover up. Gone on my nose a little bit. Sometimes I'll press a little bit if I need more. Press a little bit more onto my blending sponge and then go on with it like that. Over my eye, underneath my eye. 
and then that's it that's honestly it I do not go crazy with my foundation and add things and subtract things I really don't have the time so essentially this is what my face would look like with foundation on before I start adding things like concealer under my eyes and uh, setting powder and bronzer and all of that that is essentially my foundation routine as you can see I always like to always end off by going across my jawline because if your foundation doesn't quite match to your skin sometimes you'll see the difference on your jawline so you always have to go over like that and also on your hairline and that's pretty much it this is how I would do my foundation now I'm gonna go away and finish off my face and then I will be and there it is I am done with my makeup as you guys can see this is the foundation routine it's the most basic and easiest and everyday way that I apply my foundation if I need to move quickly and do things quickly and just get the step in this is how I apply my foundation if I've got a little bit more time then I'll play around and you know take my time when dabbing things in but honestly it's how I do my foundation every single day I hope you you guys enjoyed this video and if you did and if you'd like to see another how-to video definitely subscribe and let me know what you would like to see in the how-to series and that's it that's it I'm done I'm done until the next one I will see you very very soon bye